Hello everyone, I'm Sid the Casual Gamer and welcome back to another video. And in this video I want to tell you guys about what I've been doing. Um, I think in the last vlog, this is like a vlog, right? In the last vlog I talked about a project I was working on with my friend Austin and that project is coming to fruition. So do you guys remember D-Life? Yes, D-Life. The wonderful place, D-Life. Well, I'm decided to do it again, right? Now, I've really liked live streaming. Like, I like it on my YouTube channel. I probably spend just as much time live streaming as I do working on my videos. Like, the normal edited ones. And I, I just really enjoy live streaming. In fact, I take stupid tasks like making thumbnails and live stream them. So I'm like, okay, I have to make decisions here. So I, decisions wise, you know, I have about two years left where I live right now. Then I move, right? So what I'm going to do is I have to find a way to, I have a, I had a couple things I have to balance. I had to balance how much time I spent with my friend Austin because I really like the relationship we have as friends. And I also had to figure out um, like another, another source of income, just a more income, right? So my first option was to make more YouTube videos. Now, I don't know why, but I really don't like making collab YouTube videos. I don't know why. I just don't. Then there is some eBay stuff I could do. And then I remembered that I could make more DTube videos, but DTube's really inconsistent and kind of like kind of like a step up from YouTube, but definitely not enough. So then I realized, um, I was thinking about this, then PewDiePie said he was gonna stream on DLive, right? So DLive gained a lot of publicity. And now it's looking like a pretty viable place to make an extra bit of cash. You know, and it doesn't have to be a lot, just, you know, I'm trying to make it so within two years, the entire internet content creation thing works. That's the ideal goal, which is gonna be very hard. I'm gonna just say that right now. Okay, it's gonna be very hard. And I'm cool with that, I don't care. It's, just, it's probably just gonna take a lot of time. So I'm streaming on DLife now. Um, really, uh, DLive is, since it's a smaller platform, less competitive, I'll say, uh, basically less cr content creators than YouTube, but less viewers than YouTube. But it's kind of mitigated by their donation system where you get these Leno points. You can either buy the points or you earn them from just watching people or you get them donated to you and then you can convert them into normal US dollars. And the payouts are twice a week, I believe, if I checked. You know, you have to meet a certain threshold, which I'm totally cool with. But you get paid out every two weeks instead of where YouTube, where you get paid out every month, um, or when you hit the threshold 30 days after you hit their threshold of 100 AdSense dollars. And I'm hoping, the plan is, DLive's an extra source of cash, so it's kind of like a second uh, platform. And I've always been kind of looking for that second platform and DLive back when it was part of the Steam blockchain was that second platform for me. I made probably about fifteen hundred to two thousand dollars on DLive. Like within six months. My problem was it didn't have viewers back then, so I hated that no one was watching my content. So now that there's a decent there's a lot of people on DLive, now I'm kind of like, okay, there's to me for me, there is enough eyes on DLive and enough of a financial opportunity to make it worth my time. And I'm, you know, investing time into it now. Like, um, basically what I did was I decided I'm going to watch less YouTube videos and I'm also going to live stream what, like, I'm going to live stream when I play with Austin more. So if Austin and I are just chilling and playing like, hey, we're going to live stream. Right, because on YouTube, I'm already posting one to two videos a day, plus a live stream, that's already three notifications. If I do a community tab, it's four. There's a point where like, could you imagine getting five or six notifications off of one YouTube channel? No, a little bit too much. In my opinion, a little bit too much if it was one YouTube channel. Now, if I had like three or four different YouTube channels, it's different, but I prefer to have the one. So that's really what's going on, I'm hoping you know, make some money off of it and have another platform because if YouTube goes down, then there's DLive. If DLive goes down, then there's YouTube, you know, have that safety net of multiple platforms. And it's not that hard to like make an extra piece of content for DLive every day even. It's not really that hard. 
And for some reason, it's easier for me than making an Instagram profile. It's very, I don't know, it's, it's quite strange. And I get to live stream more. So if I just want to, like, it's the kind of thing where if I just want to chill out, I can just stream there. I, if I wanted to chill out, I could stream on YouTube as well. But like I said, too many notifications. So that's really what's going on. I have it linked up in my channel, and I believe it's in the description of very recent videos. I'll have to check that out. Um, so if you want to go there, you can go there. You can turn on notifications there too, which is really cool on the mobile app. So if you want more random live streams of me, most of the time it's right in the morning when I'm really tired and waking up. You got it. But that's really it for this video. Just want to talk about what I'm doing. Uh, if you enjoyed it, you can tell me in the comments below. And that's it. Off on another platform, off on another adventure, starting a new project. It's cool. I like it. So, Pacific Casual Gamer, I suck just as bad as you do at video games. And I will see you in the next episode, stream, vlog, or whatever post of whatever I decide to make.